the negative breakup isn't good and the both of you must reconcile and come back together to mend bridges. This positive breakup can be a result of little differences that can be resolved with understanding. You both are meant to be together forever because it is God's will and He gave you both approval from the beginning. When you have had a breakup with someone and the person is pushing for reconciliation and you also pressured from within and want differences to be settled, then that love is true. And through that reconciliation, you both would be back and continue your walk in love together. Differences are a part of a relationship. We are not fired the same way. We have a different upbringing. And all these are inevitable, but the sign that it is true love and that even after a breakup, you people would soon be back together and last longer is that there would be an effort by everybody to meet, settle and reconcile your differences. When there is a breakup, but either you or the other partner don't want to be back together because the person is feeling free and the relationship has been like hell, then the love is not true. And reconciliation is not recommended. Go out there, be guided by the Holy Spirit, and you would meet or locate your true love and true partner, who break up would not be the end, but you would break up and reconcile again and move on together. Love is not done in convenience. There must be consistent and deliberate effort between both parties. If you both have been doing this, then the breakup won't last, and both of you would be back again because you both were true in the relationship and have buried love in your hearts. And as such, what is buried has died long ago in the heart and has germinated and taken deep root. It can't be cut off by mere breakup. The love is true and the both of you would be back together again and continue in the loving and charity relationship between the both of you. Love thrives on the will of showing it. It is not only a mouth action, it requires display and you must show the love you have for your partner by how you appreciate them. If these things have a place in your relationship, then those things you people show and do for yourselves would work as a factor in bringing you both back again. You would want to come back because the both of you have enjoyed the love and have been shown love. The love you have shown your partner would work in bringing you both back and you both would reconcile and continue together again. True love develops and builds each other. If the both of you have added value to each other, helped each other and have made an impact on each other, it is true love and the breakup would not be the end. The both of you would come back and continue again. We need each other to make progress in life. Nobody is an island on their self. You can't build it alone and you need someone to do the other side or part for you. You have made an impact on that person. You have brought out the best in that person. Value has been added and the person would find it difficult to move on or continue, especially if the both of you were guided together and are operating in God's will. You would push through the breakup and have your partner back. A relationship must not be one-sided. If your partner is adding value to your life, how are you adding value to his life or her life? So, in a true love relationship, there is an addition of value and these values added would bring you both back. The way you have added value to your partner's life and have been a help and backup to the other person would make the breakup ineffective and would not last long and your partner would be back. If it's true love, you would be back together again because you have brought out the best in yourselves and added value to each other. True love endures forever. True love sees the both of you building, settling and enjoying together. Breakup won't deter partners that see the future together, are running the vision together and have planned to settle forever with concrete plans. Love is patient and sees the future. Love endures all things and love covers all wrongs. The true love that exists between the both of you would allow you both to continue. You would have breakups, but it won't last for long. You would come back and continue together again, moving and progressing to the future you see and what you intend to build together. You both would be back again. It would not last forever. You have enjoyed love. You have contributed to the lives of each other. You want to reconcile. You want to be back again. You don't want to start over with another person from scratch or partner. 
Time has been invested to build a relationship. A lot has been built together. And you both want to be back again because you have shared true and real love. You have not been stressed or passing through hell because of the relationship. What has existed is unique, sweet and true. You both would be back together again and move on together. Breakup is not the end of a relationship. Breakup is not always bad. It is time for reflection and time to mend things. It is time to critically examine yourself and know where you haven't been trying and areas you need to improve on. Every relationship is a training and building process. You need to be true, sincere and true so that the best can be achieved. Have a large heart to forgive. Don't be self-seeking. Don't be selfish. Don't be unappreciative. Love is not one-sided. It is two-faced. What you invest in is what you would receive back. When you are true and real in the relationship, the breakup would not last forever. It would not be long and you both would be back and able to move on again. To everyone who is facing breakup now or hurt, have faith in your love, especially if you believe that it is your true love. Then the universe will bring you and your lover back in the most beautiful way. Be positive no matter what. It will be difficult at first, but little by little, you will start feeling better and amazing and things will start changing the moment you get into a better feeling place. The love that has existed, the both of you, is true and you both would be back again. Let us check those signs that would show to make you know the love is true and the person. You both would come back and you both would continue again with the mandate and assignment given to the both of you. We would base this discussion on what true love means from the Bible. And the Bible explores points on true love and why despite the breakup, the person would come back. 1 Corinthians chapter 13 verse 4 to 8. Love endures with patience and serenity. Love is kind and thoughtful and is not jealous or envious. Love does not brag and is not proud or arrogant. It is not rude. It is not self-seeking. It is not provoked, nor overly sensitive and easily angered. It does not take into account a wrong endured. It does not rejoice at injustice, but rejoices with the truth when right and truth prevail. Love bears all things, regardless of what comes, believes all things, looking for the best in each other hopes all things, remaining steadfast during difficult times, and endures all things without weakening. Love never fails, it never fades nor ends. 1 Peter chapter 4 verse 8 Above all, have fervent and unfailing love for one another, because love covers a multitude of sins. It overlooks unkindness and unselfishly seeks the best for others.